Yeah, so to start, I'm, I'm using the, uh, the R11S. It's nine degrees, so it's all, all pretty standard. No, it's on neutral, yeah. standard loft, yeah. Uh, Shaft-wise, I've been using the Graffalo Blues for, I don't know, 10 years, I guess. So I just keep on, I, occasionally I try different shafts, but yeah. I've just been sticking with, with these for a long time. Well, these ones are, are X and they're a little bit tipped, so they, it's a very stiff shaft and, and uh, kind of feels a bit dead, I think, to most people, but I'm, I'm used to it. And if I had a good one, it's probably about 300 yards in the air. That's, that's kind of what we're, what we're uh, looking okay. at, if, if I hit it all right. Got the Callaway Diablo, it's 13 degrees, so it's, it's a strong three wood. It's slightly longer shaft as well. Uh, probably about half an inch longer and gives me a very strong ball flight. Uh, well, I hit it both off, uh, a lot of times off the deck, I'd say. It gives me a, probably an easier, easier chance of getting a real stinger, you know, when I hit it off the, off the turf. I give it a little hack down, get a little mound and, you know, from there on we go. And this, that's kind of been one of my, one of my favorites over the years. I got an old five wood here. It's uh, that one's only been in a couple of weeks there because I had an issue with with my uh, with my other five wood. So that's kind of a bit of a old old timer that came back in yeah. for a little while. But it was in the bag when I won here in South Africa uh, oh, okay. in November. So uh, we'll see if it if it keeps its place in the in the lineup here. Yeah, I mean those were the ones I used before I put the uh, octanes in there. So just the old big Bertas. I used those for a lot of years. Uh, so I had a three wood and the five plus, and then. Now I got the 13 and 18 in, in these ones normally. Three to, three to pitching wedge, uh, the racer tour. Uh, put those in right, uh, roughly just over two years ago and okay. had those in not the same set, but I've had the same the same type in for, and it's just like, I've, I've been used to playing something that's a little bit more oversized, but it still, uh, it still looks very nice, uh, these ones, I think. So, you know, I got really a mixed bag. I got all the different manufacturers, so hopefully they all send me a little uh, little check, each one of them. These ones, I got the, uh, the Modus from Nippon. I've had those in for a year and a half, um, and I think they gave me a slightly stronger ball flight, especially into the wind, so I've been been quite happy with those ones. They snap a little bit easier though, so be be careful with your hands. And then for wedges, I got a pair of old Clevelands, the old uh, old style Cleveland wedges that kind of came out with the new grooves. And I got the 51 and the 58. Uh, actually, I, I used to have 52 and 58, but I put 51 in and that just bridged that gap a little bit because of the strong pitching wedge. So oh, okay. that made that one, one and a half degree made uh, made quite a bit, bit of, of a difference there for me. Peretti putters. Mm -hmm. It's a new brand from America, uh, and this is like a it says tour only, very special. Uh, yeah, little lion. You can do a little lion dance for us here if you want. Yeah. You and uh, this one is about 34 inch, okay, and 6'2", six uh, two, six two, six two, yeah. But I think I think most people would probably benefit from a slightly shorter putter. I know standard is about 35 inch, yeah. but it looks like people get more comfy if they if they use something around 34 inch I think and these ones are, are heavily weighted as well they'll come a bit heavier so they're they're quite nice even if you if you have a shorter one they still give you a nice feel